Okay, here's um, just a quick sample of how to set up and run code blocks. Um, when, when, after you've installed it, you should have a screen look similar to this. I've kind of shrunk mine down to fit on the video. Um, basically, everything that works in code blocks is going to be part of a project. So we want to create a new project, which is here on the Start Here screen, or you can go under File, New Project. Either way is the same. Uh, what it gives you is a screen of templates that are different types of projects, kind of putting the code in there to start off with. Um, we're always going to do a console application uh, in this semester, so I'm going to select console application and hit go. And the next piece it gives us is just a page saying we selected what we selected, so I'm going to skip this page next time so we don't see it. Um, then we want C or C++. We're going to we're doing C++ this semester, so we're going to select C++. And now it's asking for the title, which is basically um, what the file names are going to be to where it's going to be stored in the name of the folder. Um, so I'm just going to call this one sample. Um, it's going to ask where to create it. Um, if you're using like a, a USB drive or something like that, that would be um, the place to do it. So you'd hit the two dots and, and select it. Um, I'm just going to stick it on, um, oh, I don't know. Um, we'll put it in um, oh I don't have an obvious place to put it so let me make a new folder called CSC 123 okay so um, it's in my CSC 123 notice that there's a project folder sample CBP um, and then the resulting file name oh, we'll look at the files in a second Okay, I'm going to hit next. Um, hopefully, if you pick the right wor version to install, it should have the GNU C++ compiler on there. If you have other things, it may have other compilers, like if you've installed other software. Maybe on there. We're going to click on Finish. Hopefully, everything should be fine. And, ah, things have changed. Over here, it shows us the projects we have open. Um, sample is the name of the project I gave it. Uh, over here is Sources. I'm going to open the Sources. Here's main CPP and here in rather tiny print um, is the template or the default that it gives us. Um, to run it um, I prefer to hit the F9 key so if I 9 key uh, oh maybe if maybe my recording software is messing with the F9 key um, there's the build and run which should be F9 I hit build and run it compiles it over here and it popped up a program which shows it. So here's hello world, um, process return zero, how long it took to run and stuff like that. Uh, if I make changes to my program, uh, well correct changes, <laughs> that's I guess what the whole semester is about. Hit build and run again, and I get those changes on my output. So this is sort of the, the basics of how to to build and run it.